All right, so this is part of my uh, my travel setup. Um, I'm sleeping in the 2005 Nissan Xterra here, and uh, I basically went to Walmart and bought some cord, <clears throat> just some nylon cord here, and I tied it to uh, you can't really see, but I tied it to the very front uh, visor, I guess the mount that runs into the ceiling, and tied it to the other one, running all the way around the roof, and went and bought some of those fleece throws. So now I actually have fleece lined uh, Xterra fleece curtains. Um, let me get in and uh, I'll show you just how dark it is in pretty much broad daylight. Alright, it's like 3 o'clock in the afternoon and this is what the interior looks like. Uh, it's not pitch black dark, but it is, uh, it is pretty dark. There's a couple places where the sun shines through, but if you have all these other lights off, um, it's pretty dark in here. So that works really good for uh, you know for sleeping. If I sleep past when the sun rises, seven, eight, nine o'clock, uh, it works really well. And this uh, this pad is really comfortable. So, works out. So with all this talk of traveling around and uh, no mention of work. Uh, you're probably wondering what I do for money. Um, I actually do web design, so anywhere I have uh, access to the internet, I can just get online and uh, you know look for jobs on Craigslist. What I mostly do, I have uh, two clients now, possibly a third client pretty soon that pays me weekly or monthly, or actually bi-weekly. So uh, <clears throat> that's bringing in about 900 to 1100 dollars a month right now, which is decent. Uh, keeps me afloat, but I'm always looking for new jobs. Um, you know, miscellaneous stuff. I'm going to be in an area for a while, get on Craigslist, and just look up the jobs in that area. And sometimes you can find, you know, like a one day thing or a part time thing. It may be something you're really interested in, or it may just be a shit job, but you know, it's money. So you get the experience of whatever you're doing, which is really cool. You have a story to tell and all that. So that's cool. But uh, yeah, that's what I do now is uh, web design. So if you need a website, holler at me. Well, I finally achieved my goal. I took everything that I brought from Georgia and have condensed it down to a 60 liter backpack. Uh, it's actually probably about 40 liters maybe. Um, I still have quite a bit of room. So anyway, let's take a look at what I've packed. All right, let's start with the clothes. Uh, I have an entire top and bottom completely waterproof outfit. Uh, I've got this one pair of pants, two pair of pants, Three pair of pants. This pair of pants and this jacket both are windproof and micro fleece lined. They're both mountain hardware. I'm a huge mountain hardware fan. Love everything they have. Uh, this is a long sleeve sweater, kind of medium thickness. I have uh, eight t-shirts. I don't have a t-shirt on now, so I have eight t-shirts total. Two pair of shorts, two dress shirts, just a little pin stripe. Uh, seven pairs of boxers, three pairs of socks. I may add one or two more pairs of socks. I'm not sure. Uh, this is a lava lava or a sarong. A lot of you know it as a sarong. For men, I think it's called a lava lava. I'm not sure. I have to check. A uh, pair of flip flops, a pair of shoes, some toilet paper spork, uh, toothpaste, deodorant, headlamp. This is a pack towel by Cedar Summit. Small first aid kit, some cord. This is actually a uh, hand soap and a little piece of Velcro and matches. Everything that I have clothes-wise uh, fits into this uh, Sea to Summit pack here, or bag. It's a, it's a stuff sack. It's a medium size uh, Sea to Summit stuff sack, and it will compress down about to the size of a large cantaloupe, maybe, something like that. Um, but everything I have will fit inside of this Ether 60 liter backpack by Osprey right here. This is my sleeping bag. Um, I do need to add a sleeping pad. I have one now. It's a little big. Um, kind of looking at the Thermarest Neo Air. It's really small. You can stuff it inside of a water bottle. So, anyway, that's everything that I have packed uh, into the backpack. I think that's going to be everything I need. I'm not positive. I'm sure there'll be stuff that I'm like, oh shit, I forgot this or that. Have to buy it. You know, that's cool. Um, I'm really just have to think hard about when I buy something. Like, you know, have I needed this more than once? Am I going to need it more than once? And, uh, you know, just justify what I buy. Cause I don't want to be spending money on just random stuff. I don't have anywhere to put it really. All right, I say I don't have anywhere to put anything, but I just repacked it all. Uh, it weighs 22 pounds total, still really light. I put the sleeping bag inside the pack so it's less bulky. Um, so I could definitely add some stuff. I probably have 15, 20 liters maybe that I could add to it if I needed to. That The uh, lid also is not even probably half full of all the stuff. Um, 
Another side note, today is my birthday officially by about 10 minutes. Uh, my grandmother and my mom sent me a card in the mail. Thank you, love you very much. I'll open those later. Tomorrow, uh, next video, see so this is video number three. Video number four, I'm actually going to San Francisco tomorrow, which is my birthday. Um, the next day, let's see, actually the 22nd, I'm picking up a, a couch surfer from Miami. Um, she's coming out, we're going to go do some hiking in Yosemite. So now they got a good video camera, I'll take videos of all that. And I kind of want to give you a summary of a couch surfing trip. Maybe talk to her, see if she has anything she wants to add to it. Uh, to give you a better idea of what couch surfing is and what you might do if you go couch surfing with somebody. Um, you know, find out how she got into it and all this kind of stuff. So anyway, that's the pack. It's my birthday. I am uh, celebrating just a little. But uh, anyway, that's it. So I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Video 4, I guess that's 8. Video 4, uh, San Francisco. Woo! Don't stop the back, don't, don't stop the back, don't, don't stop the back, you hear the people say, don't stop, don't stop the back, you don't, don't stop the